Iran is a country in West Asia, and if you need to know one fact about Iran, is that Iran is the country of poetry and poets. I wouldn't exaggerate if I say poets are like prophets for Iranians. They are the ones who know the mystery of life. People in Western world, they generally know Rumi and maybe Hafez. With a few exceptions, less than the fingers of one hand, most of our great poets had been men throughout our history. One of the first Persian women poets whose works were published and read by millions of Iranians is Parvine Etesami. Parvin was born in 1907 in Tabriz. Her family moved to Tehran in 1912. Her father, Etesam mulk was a literary man. Parvin's father very early on recognized his daughter's talents. So he worked with her closely to cultivate Parvin's interest in literature and poetry. He taught her Persian and Arabic literature. She started writing poetry as early as eight years old. By the time she was 11, she knew all Iranian great poets and was very well versed with different styles of composing poetry. Eventually, he entered Parvin in American College for Girls, a school established by an American missionary organization in 1874 where she learned English and became familiar with the Western culture. Parvin graduated from the college in 1925. Shortly after she graduated, she received an invitation to become the tutor of the queen of the new Pahlavi dynasty, but she refused this offer. While Parvin never claimed to be a feminist, she did not fit in traditional role of a wife. In 1934, she married her cousin, but she left that marriage after two months. Then she dedicated her entire short life to composing poetry. A collection of her poetry with an introduction by the Iranian great poet Malako Shuaray Bahar was published in 1935. In her poems, Parvin expresses her love and desire for social justice and shows her sorrow and despise for the injustices in this world. She was an advocate for education. In her graduation speech, she spoke about the importance of education for all Iranians, regardless of their gender and their social class. Ruzi Gozash Padeshahi as Gozagahi فریاد شوق بر سر هر کوی و بام خواست پرسید زن میانه یکی کودک یتیم که این تابناک چیست بر تاج پادشاست آن یک جواب داد چه دانیم ما که چیست پیداست آنقدر که متایی گران بهاست نزدیک رفت پیر زنی گوش پشت و گفت این عشق دیده منو in 1941, when she was only 34, she died from typhoid fever. Parvine Etesami, this modest and shy but yet firm and strong woman, lives in the hearts of millions of Iranians. Her poetry is being recited on daily basis all over Iran.